Hello? Hello? Who is this? Uh, am I speaking to the... <sighs> wrong number. No, what do you mean I've gotten the wrong number? Am I speaking to the lady by the pharmacy? I said you've got the wrong number. This is Josh. For the last time, young man, you've been given the wrong number. Bye. Who was it? Just a very disappointed young man. Hmm. Hey, Josh. What's another word for when something is emitting light? You know, like glowing. Uh, shining? Yeah, no, 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 no. Something more fancy. Something fancy. Yes, yes, yes. I need another name for it, but with a bit of class. You know, something posh. You know what I mean? Okay, um... Okay, can you give me an example in a sentence? Oh, come on! Like... You emit light through your surface. <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing, nothing. I'll play along. Okay, fancy, fancy word for glowing. How about... Oh, right. So, how about radiance or glimmer? Brilliant! Thank you. You're welcome. What are you doing? I just want to know what you're writing. Why? Perhaps so I can... Perhaps so I can help with some portionless or classy synonyms for your love letter. Well, of course you can... Wait, wait, who told you I'm writing a love letter? Aren't you writing a letter? Yes. But it doesn't have to be a love letter. So, it's a hatred letter. No, it's a... <laughs> well, I... <laughs> Fine. Oh, snap! You have... I mean, wait. You have found yourself a red rose in a beautiful garden, I suppose, Master J. I suppose, Master Josh. <laughs> yes. So I go to open the letter. Wait, 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 wait. So, who is she? Where did you find her? Tell me everything. Why all the information? Well, because... No, 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 no. Enough with the Swiss cheese acting. Well, I mean, if I'm going to help compose a classy letter, we should at least get some background information, shouldn't we? I suppose. Okay. You want to know who she is? It's the young attendant at the pharmacy across the street. Oh. I see. Yes, yes, yes. We got talking and I told her that I wanted us to be closer. I see. Yes, 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 yes. I asked her for a number and I told her I would send her a message and then I'll give her a call. I see. Yes, yes, yes. So, I want to compose a lovely, super classy love letter before giving her a phone call. <laughs> I see. Hey, hey, hey. It was not like you were previously blind before. I mean, what's with all the scene? So, you met her at the store, and you were wowed, and you want to know her better. Correct. Whew, I have so many questions. Okay, so, what is the future plan of this, this connection? How do you mean? I mean, what's the end goal to this closeness? Marriage? Marriage? Who said anything about marriage? Hey, did I mention that I asked her for her address? Yes. You asked her for her address. And she said she'll give me when I call her. Isn't that amazing? Why are you visiting her, Josh? Honestly, I'm not sure, but it's like I have this strange urge to, to visit. Like a voice telling you to go see her repeatedly over and over. Right. And the voice gets louder and louder each time, like an actual person standing close to you. Right, right. I mean, how did you know that? Go to her. Go to her. Visit her. Visit her. Hey, 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 hey. Who are you? <laughs> Duh. No, 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 no. I didn't invite you here. Please leave. But you're getting involved with someone solely based on how your flesh feels. Now, if that is not inviting this guy over, I don't know what is. That's not true. I didn't invite him. Ouch. 
Seriously, that hurts my feelings, bro. Technically, going to a secluded place to meet a lady is... Surely inviting him along. Thank you. Look, 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 look. She's just a friend. It's just a visit. That's it. <laughs> I've heard that one before. All right, let's fall back a little bit. Now, this love letter you're writing, is it something her parents would be okay reading? Uh... And this meeting you're hoping for, would you be okay if I came along? Uh... <laughs> Strike two! All right, all right, all right, I got one, I got one, I got one. Now, this meeting, if she makes any moves, will you bow to the temptation? Or will you, or will you agree to her advancements? <laughs> okay, that's practically the same thing. It's the same option. <laughs> I am lost. I tempt. What do you expect? Give him a way out? All right, all right, all right, all right. I've had it with this conversation. All I needed was a simple help in my letter writing. But you know what? I'll call her directly right now. Y you don't have to. Shh. Hello. 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 Am I speaking to you? I speaking got the to wrong number, young man. You got the wrong number, young man. <laughs> Remember that call earlier today? Victim number one. You, my friend, second victim. <laughs> And for the record, I know this person. <laughs> She's married. <laughs> nice plot twist. <laughs> but I mean, look at the bright side. Actually, you go to the place, and then you meet her husband, and then it's written out your so-called posh and classy love letter. <laughs> Imagine the embarrassment. <laughs> <coughs> mm.